Each country had its own heritage, culture, and history of perfume. The discovery of this important patrimony is giving birth today to a new understanding of the cultural importance of perfume. The reading of old documents shows us that people have used perfume and have been experimenting on improving the art of making perfume throughout history. In every religion and in every language, sacred writing shows the beneficial power of bones on perfumed oil. In ancient Egypt, perfumes play a crucial role. Sacred, they enable humans to cross from life to death. In life, each rite has its own scent. A myriad caravan routes cross Arabia, from Oman to the Gulf of Suez. Silk routes, spice routes, perfume routes cross the desert from south to north through one of the most ancient and splendid landscapes on our planet. A divine odor exhales from Arabia. While spices originate in India and musk from China, Oman and Yemen in the south of prosperous Arabia produce myrrh and incense. When the Queen of Sheba hears about Salomon, she travels 3,000 kilometers to Jerusalem with a large convoy of camels in order to obtain a guarantee of free circulation on the road of perfume. In 16th century China, people carried medicines, cosmetic products, and perfumes in tobacco bags. During the Song Dynasty, fragrances played a part with each event in life. Seasons, music, meditation, poetry, and love. Like China, Japan has an age-old, deeply refined perfume culture. The ancient art of Kodo, the incense way or path, is part of a ritual similar to the tea ritual. India is a great land in the world of perfume. Its vast territory, its rituals and Islamic influences explain its title as the Land of a Thousand Scents. Atta perfumes in Hindi are an essential feature in everyday Indian life. Indians use silver sprinklers to perfume floors with saffron or vetiver rose water. For religious ceremonies, they cover them with flowers. Incense sticks are burnt as offerings to the gods. Marketplaces are a feast for the senses, a bounty of bright colors and thousands of spiced fragrances and flowery scents. The art of perfume reaches Europe when relations with the East develop during the Crusades between the 11th and 13th centuries. The East teaches the West its science and conveys its spices and perfumes. Welcome aboard. Let's us go together to the world of perfume. 